Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Modular Mayhem Reloaded with Trix2. So this series is going to come to a close. Uh it's not that I'm not enjoying it and not that I don't want to keep playing it. I need torches. It's that I can't update. I tried and basically I lose my world. It just doesn't work. It breaks. I thought New Metacraft was the culprit, and it was to an extent. It was this particular pipe here, this little elbow that was causing me trouble. And then the pack updated again, and I thought, oh, maybe I can update to that. Unfortunately, that pack update just completely destroyed my world. Every everything, uh, Biomes of Plenty apparently changed all of its ID IDs, and unfortunately, that meant that. Everything that used the Biomes of Plenty ID and such it changed. So all of, which meant that this platform just vanished. These these the thermal ex which changed the thermal expansion IDs, which somehow turned these into nothing. The ducting beneath them into a fluid of some description turned all of this into various fluids, completely destroyed ex extra utilities too. Uh, all of the platforms things turned into a uh, candle? Turned into Pam's brown candles, which was really weird. Uh, these turned into some kind of future pack blo metal block. So yeah. I will will not be updating the pack further. Um, there's a couple of things I want to do because I haven't done them before. One, uh, it's not killing killing the Ender Dragon because I've done that before. It is. Uh, that's not what I wanted to click on. It is actually making a Dragon Egg Mill, which I haven't ever done before. So we're going to teleport to the. We're going to teleport to the desert. Excuse me. There we go. We were lagging slightly. So, end portal is purple this way. There we go. Yeah, so we're going to go and we're going to kill the... <coughs> we're not going to kill the Ender Dragon. We're going to teleport home because I've forgotten the piston. Piston? Excuse me. Piston. They aren't that complicated. Thank you. Eh. Uh, nope, we need a lever. Yeah, I don't think I have a lever. I might have a lever in here. Oh, I did have levers, so that's fine. Alright, so we'll try this again. We will wait for the lag, because this pack is very laggy for some reason. Yeah, it, it really really laggy. I think that's Biomes of Plenty being problematic, for, really. If I had started this later, after it was all traverse biomes, I might be able to continue, but sadly I did not. Um, Iskandar didn't know traverse existed, which, you know, that's perfectly fair. And we will continue to lag as we drop. However, we are now ready to... Alright, first of all, you need to go in here. Are you soul bound? You're soul bound, so if I drop you, well... I won't lose my bag. I think my hammer is also soul bound. And we can teleport to the end, where we can then engage in glorious battle with the Ender Dragon. And get its egg. Unfortunately, being able to fly means that we can, you know, deal with all of these crystals. Um, I'm a very bad bow shot. I was going to play with some matter overdrive, I was going to play with some more future pack. Future pack is a mod that I like the idea of, but it's so hard to get into. 
excuse me. I fired an arrow. Game? Okay, fine. Okay, there we go. The game decided it did not want it to lag. That's fine. Can we shoot through here? Maybe? Apparently not. Alright, uh, how about straight from above? Nope. Fine. We'll give it the hammer. Give it a good hammering. Ow. I've managed to blow myself up because the game lagged. Uh, no. Game? Please stop. Um, right. I need food and I need it quickly. And also I need... Thank you. Um, I needed cork to go away. But it's silly menu, multiple menu thing. Alright, let's break this one instead. There we go. So that now I can blow that up. Whoa! No! Blow that up with... Okay, those haven't actually been removed. Suck it. Ow. Okay, this lag is really... Right, let's try that again, shall we? There we go. That should be all the crystals, which means you're now a corpse. Come on. Game, don't lag. Game, seriously. There we go. Whoa. Ah. I do like having... Come here. And we've lagged. Um, I'm going to keep trying to move this way. Yeah, yeah, I can fly and you idiots can't. Come here, you. Um. Ah. We've reached this stage where we can't be hurt by ranged weapons, but I have a hammer. Nope, nope, up, up, up. It's not yet. Alright, and we're lagged out. Yep. Okay. And you're back to being hammered. Yeah. Whoa, okay. Yep. Hey, excuse me. Flying a straight line when I'm trying to shoot you within a bow and arrow. Whoops. Ah, missed me. There we are. Whoops. Not quite what I had in mind. Okay, Enderman. Okay, Frenderman. Come have. Come get some. Come to me, Frenderman. Okay, we're still lagged. Let's get up in the air. Alright, look. <clears throat> Alright, <coughs> lag continues. There we go. Come on. Okay, lag. This is not funny. And it's something to do specifically with this pack. It is not, does not happen in my custom pack for some reason. Ha, ha gotcha. Ooh. Magic stuff. Uh, under biotite and celestial crystal shards. Fair enough. Ooh, nebulous heart. And all the ender pearls I could ever want, if I ever wanted ender pearls. Yep, I'm gonna suck up all the experience. There we go. 
and we can now get our uh, dragon egg as soon as I get myself a wrench so I can rotate the piston. There we go. There we are. Grab our lever. Uh. Okay. Fine. There we are. One dragon egg. I will have my piston back, thank you. I did not mean to fall through the end credits. Okay, yes, no one cares. And we should be teleported home momentarily, since the game decides it's done lagging. Huzzah! Teleported back to our spawn. <sighs> so, that's. Te I mean, technically, that's the end of the game. The game has now decided it wants to lag more. Thank you. Please stop that. Technically, that's the end of the game. Uh, it, it was the it was the end added when they actually put Minecraft into its 1.0 release state. But now we have a dragon egg. So dragon egg egg. So we need a dragon egg mill. That requires nether stars. Nether clusters come from nether shards, which come from ender essence, which come from... Oh. So, uh... Oh, I do need more than... Mm -hmm. I need to fight a wither. What about this? This is easy. Um, I kind of hate fighting withers. Like, I'm really terrible at it. And the game's lagging again. I... Yeah, um, you know what? My answer is this. Let's forget the Dragon Egg Mill. I've completed the game. I have completed all of this stuff and nonsense. Sunstone. What on earth do you do with Sunstone? No, we don't want Summon Puppy. We want to know what the solar is. Okay. What is its special trick? Yes, we don't. We can do torch bandoliers. We can do weapons. Apparently, it has no enchantment mechanism. Curious. All right. Uh, what do we do with supercharged sunstone? That's special. It is. Uh, Base harvest speed 11, harvest level 4. Good protection against melee and magic damage. G has good melee and good magic damage. Yeah, it seems to be just designed for protection. Right, well, uh, let's go down here. We should have everything we need. Where's my toast? Where's my toast? I'm kind of sad to see this world go. But at the same time, I've kind of reached the stop it end of my I, I there's nothing more I can do in this world. Let's go and press you on this. Um, not that we need to make fuel out of this. One two thirty five and f seven two thirty eights. What do we have? Two thirty five and two thirty eight. So, what do we need to do? Make you like this. That gets us a two thirty five, and then that I assume. There we go. One leu two thirty five fuel. So. Fuel, um, L-E-U, and then what do we do with this? We, now, how do we stuff this into, ah, uh, right, so we can just make 
So what, do you just go straight into the machine? Into the reactor? I mean, that would be awesome if you did. Ah, you need a lever. Well, fortunately, I have left my lever at home. Good job, me. Let's go grab a... Rather, I left my lever in the end. We'll grab our lever. And now, if I have done all this calculation correctly, this should produce, I think it's like 1400 RF per tick. Oh, my goodness. Um, this is producing way more. Right. I think something changed. Or I'm using the wrong fuel. Yes, indeed. I am definitively using the wrong fuel. Uh, okay. We, in that short time, we, it uh, did 10, 100, 500,000 RF per tick. Um, holy moly. Um, okay. Yeah, nuclear craft updated. Haha. <laughs> wow. Alright. Well, that was the other thing I wanted to... Game, can you stop? Please? Thank you. Yeah, that stuff burns very, very hot. You're not going to do what I want you to do. Yeah, what what burns cold that I am... Yeah, um... What did I make that... I feel as though I have done something hilariously wrong here. Okay, these numbers are not quite adding up. I mean, it's a ton of power generation, but um, it's way more heat generation than I thought it should than it should be. Uh, okay. Um. I can't think of anything else. Oops, no. Yeah, I have 22 grains of infinity. The problem is, I, I have now run out of ideas as to what I can do to make, to continue this series. Um, I guess we'll go on a short world tour here. And I, this will have to be the last episode of the series. That's kind of sad to me. Uh, this was my first house. I lo Game, stop with the lagging. I'm trying to be sentimental here. My first house, spruce wood planks. I love I love doing the windows li windows like this. I don't believe... Can you actually shoot through these? Game. Pl Game. Seriously, the lag. It is not funny. Ah, you can shoot through these. Interesting. I have to remember that. Um, we have Marble Road here, is our flooring. Uh, was it this one? No. Uh, I think it was over here. No. I know I'm not, I buried it in one of these corners. Ah, here we go. Wooden storage crate. This is all of the refined storage system. The controller, the crafting grid, the 4K storage disk, and the disk drive. And it, everything for refined storage is on this 4K disk. Except for those two pieces that need that it needed if I ever decided ever wanted to pull it out again. But we had this little house here. It was a nice little house. We had our nether portal, which I cast and didn't show off how to do. We had my repair box. Uh, you can see I've taken a little bit of armor. Game, come on. Can we let stop with the lagging? Thank you. And we got a little chaos note in here. We have toasters, so I could cook toast while I was waiting. And these, this would slowly repair all of my gear. Yep, you just heard it do it. And it would repair not only my uh, 
silence tools, but all my other tools as well. So, once I got out of here, I... Excuse me. I have a bad shot with a Minecraft bow. There we go. Yeah. So once I got out of my house, I come up here and built this platform up here because I had gotten my angel ring to let me fly. Um, I yeah, I have 162 grid power because I was using red coal to run my pneumaticraft setup, and I built machines. I moved my storage up here. I built this. This is my favorite part of extra utilities too is the magical wood. It means I can use six magical wood instead of 15 bookshelves. Oops. A batania is a little bit better since it's just, you know, a couple of mana pylons and you're go good. I I've said it, I think I said it before. I really like uh, Future Pack, but it's such a nightmare. I did research the assembly table. I guess we can poke at this a bit. Yeah. And you need SP and energy and neon energy. Um, here, how about you come with me? Either the game has lagged or I have just destroyed that with my pickaxe. Oh, the game lagged, okay. Can I do this? Can I just place you there? Yes, you get energy. I, I have no clue how to use this. Um, assembler? Uh, right, yes, that's not exactly a helpful thing. Uh, future pack manual, please. I'm not sure why one of them is green and one of them is not. Uh, whoa. Okay. Basics, we have this unlocked. Not sure what. Oops. All right. Well, it seems like there's just research we can do. Let's give it a shot. Uh, scan. Probably not hydraulics. I, I noticed we had neon energy clicked. Uh, morphology. Nope. Geology. Chemistry. Yeah, uh, this is not as boring as some of the old Farmcraft researches. Oh, hello. How about thermodynamics with it? If not, power connection. Uh, power connection? Nope. Metallurgy. Alright, engineering maybe. And hydro. Okay, we. Right, sure. Uh, we need a bucket of milk. Uh, we have a. Okay. We do have a bucket, and we have cows floating around. I just have to go find one. Ah, there's Mr. Cow. Um, I don't know if this will eat the bucket. If it does, well. Like I said, I want to end the series here. I kind of want to end the series here. I love it. This is milk. Oh, it now has a time estimate, which I don't believe it had beforehand. Uh, do we need something else here, or? Uh, oh, we're we're lagging. That's why. Game, please don't lag. I. I really hate that it's lagging out and that I can't update and it is I love this pack. I really I like this okay, I like this pack. I loved the original one. And if I go play that one I'll ha I'm sorry, it's Kandar, but I will have to go I have to put immersive engineering or not immersive engineering, engineer's toolbox back into there. I just not having that is fluid logistics. Uh, the transport of liquids with the help of buckets is very expensive, so I developed a pipeline that allows me to improve the transport and storage of logistics of liquids. New research available in logistics, um, which is where logistics. Right, uh, fluid tanks. Uh, if 
filled sturdy glass and metal tanks can hold eight buckets of liquid. Tanks can be placed side by side and on, on top of one another to construct a larger tank. Right. Uh, game? Please stop. I've accidentally pressed escape, which means it's now going to lag. Yes. Fluid tubes. Uh, copper parts, copper ingots gets me four fluid tubes. Developed a pipeline for the transport of liquids. The tube can be placed freely while unwanted connections can be disconnected using the scrunch or the logistic editor. Uh, when the liquid is released in the pipeline, it attempts to transport the fluid to a valid destination. Right. Uh, can we make a... Okay. We have those. We do not have... Come on. Please stop lagging, game. Pain? We do have glass panes. I think it was glass panes. I hope it is, because I'm going to be annoyed if it's not. There we are. We'll get one fluid tank. And... Uh, actually, we'll just... Logistics. Nope. M might be, um... Grab some copper. Uh, we need the part press. We'll need... Coal is fine. Like I said, we're I might run this one a little bit longer just to... Come on. This lag is just killer and I don't know what's causing it. Oops. Uh, nope, we do not have lag goggles in here. It's fine. Uh, yeah, we'll just put all this in here, put the coal in here. And let it just press out as much as it wants. Alright, well it presses out quite a lot, so we'll grab another half stack of copper. While that's making pressing noises, we can... Oh, I had some in there. Ha. Huh. Grab those. Clear that. Right. Uh, how about this? Right. Scan that. Uh, probably hydraulics. Now that I'm thinking, thinking with my with my brain. Engineering, maybe. Oh. Power connection. No. Morphology. No. Geology, perhaps? No. Metallurgy? Pro probably for better pipes. No. Biology, perhaps. Oh, because I had that. I had geology selected, so. Uh, we'll just try them in order then. I missed thermodynamics last time. Chemistry? No. Um. Yeah, okay. So it is flagging me up as having another piece missing here. Um, what? Okay. That was really weird. Uh, huh. <coughs> now, it should not be a case of... Yes, we're flagging you. There's two parts, but that you need another research to do this. It, at least as far as I know it shouldn't. Oh, hello. Fluid pump. Fluid tubes and copper coils. Oh, game. Right. We'll go a little further into this. Uh, come on. More fluid tubes and two copper coils. Do I, do I have copper coils? Coil? 
copper coils are <coughs> one of those in my fluid tubes. I'll put you in there and you in there. <coughs> and this needs no no energy, so it's simply waiting for the lag to stop. Oh, it does need energy. All right, fair enough. I mean, like I said, I really like Future Pack. I will probably play with Future Pack in another mod pack. If, if <coughs> um, since this one is ending, and it, like I said, it's sad that it's ending, but it, this lag makes it unplayable. And I'm not even sure what's causing the lag. Um, but I'll definitely be playing with this in another mod pack. I just have to find one that also includes it. Or And if I can't, then I'll probably build a mod pack around it. Um, not sure how I'd do that, but, you know, I mean, it's, it's such a n nice mod. Even if it just takes forever to get into. Actually, now my brain is running, and I think I might have an idea of how to do it. So we'll complete this research, and we'll have a look at it. It should be under logistics, I think. The fluid pump. I've developed a pump to transport fluids better. The pump contains a computer system and can be upgraded to increase throughput. In addition to the operating speed based on RAM, it also depends on the performance of the transport chipsets. The pump can be supplied with neon energy from each side. On the sides, I installed tube connectors, a green one for input and a red one for output. The pump will suck liquid from all sources connected by tubes and store it in an internal tank. On the output side, the pump tries to transfer the liquid to a valid destination. Buckets can be emptied and filled through the GUI. A filter can be set in the upper central slot to limit the pump to a specific fluid. That's kind of useful. Huh. Yeah. Um. I did get accessing s game. Can you please? Thank you. So I did get access to the circuits, but they're a little awkward to work with. Neon parts, iron ingots, and silicon wafers gets me RAM. Actually, what what did the pump require to make? You have to click a little harder than I am. Well, it's not actually that bad. Composite metal, copper coils, and fluid tanks. Yeah, and then theoretically, okay. Nope, you're what I want. Nope. Fluid pump. Pump. Um, pump. There we are. We can make those. We can make those. We can make that. Which, then, if the game will ever stop lagging, we could theoretically research. However, I think we've kind of reached the end of... Okay, I'm not quite sure what that's... Aha! Fluid intake? Alright, I have to... I have to know. What do you want? Grid blocks and fluid tank? Grid block? Uh, what's a grid block? Ah. Something that we're going to need this for. Hey, as it turns out, we have a whole bunch of iron bars. Iron bars will need a grid block, which we need. Um. No, how do we make that? Thank you. Give the game a moment to catch up. Grid block, we'll need those. What else did you need? A fluid tank. Good tank. 
which is one of these, which fortunately we can make. And one, two, and a fluid tank. This is going to require a lot more energy than I have, I think. Well, especially because I don't. My generator is in my pocket. Um, right. Lag, stop! Right. Uh, we'll put that in there so that this gets all the energy it needs. Wow, you need a lot of energy, don't you? The lag is not helping in the slightest. <sighs> yeah, so... I, I know the other thing that I have not done. While that's running, we'll go over here. I did set up this farm for future pack alutine crystals, which are basically an infinite source of aluminum. Something I wish I had in my custom pack. Uh, neon crystals over here. Uh, wheat and industrial hemp, which I was using for string, but also using for the windmill that I built to power m my refined storage system, which I never actually finished. Uh, we'd seen the reactor here. Oops. Which, yeah, produces a lot more juice than I thought it did. 4,000 RF per tick. I have no comprehension of how I could possibly cool that enough to actually run it. Um, I did come over here, I started doing astral sorcery. Uh, this... Um, you know what? We can... Let's go ahead and set, this, set time to midnight. And this is still broken. This is one of the things that was should have been up fixed when we updated, but it didn't. Which, again, it's kind of sad because I like this mod. Why did I have... Apparently I started up another platform over here and I don't quite know why. We'll go back to the daytime. Yeah, I like, like I said, I really like this pack, but it just kind of... I must have done something wrong because the whole thing just kind of fell apart on me. And you're still going. Yeah, so this has been... Modular Mayhem Reloaded with Triax 2. Oh, I know what else I want to show. I, this is probably my favorite implementation of the Inscribers for Light Energistics 2. I never even got to building advanced Inscribers, but I, having everything down here below this platform and the ability to come down here and work on it was a ton of fun for me. I even started to get into Ender IO. But yeah, this has been oops. This has been Let's Play Modular Mayhem Reloaded with Triax 2. And it's signing off for the last time. Goodbye.